morning everyone, it's Adam with Seaside Vacations. I'm at the Lillian Street Beach Access in Kitty Hawk this morning with your beach report for Thursday, October 13th. Another gorgeous fall day. The sun has returned. We've actually had some rain hanging out with us for the past couple days. We had a storm system that was sitting off the coast, but luckily that has moved off and the sun has returned. We got bright blue skies, bright sun, temps hovering around 70 degrees and water temps pretty much the same. I think they're at 68 degrees this morning. So definitely a great time to be down here. Looks like this weather is going to stick with us. Checked out the five and 10 day forecast this morning. It looks like it's pretty much the same thing for the next 10 days. The sun's going to stick with us. Temps are going to hover around 70 degrees. So definitely a great time to be down here. The beaches are empty. The air is warm. The water's warm. And today we've actually got some surf coming through. We've got some decent swell, probably in the waist to chest high range. And we've got a, a nice offshore breeze, probably only about five to seven miles per hour coming out of the southwest this morning. Uh, that's actually going to switch. So this morning's the time to get out if you're down here. The uh, clean waves are going to disappear this afternoon or at least get a little bit messy this afternoon as the wind switches to the south. But luckily uh, that wind's actually going to switch back at offshore and stick with us throughout the weekend. We're going to have a nice offshore breeze, probably only about 10 miles per hour heading out of the west for Friday, Saturday and Sunday. So we're going to have nice clean waves. Unfortunately, the swell is going to die down a little bit, probably only going to be in the waist high range, but they're going to be nice and clean and the weather's going to be gorgeous. So probably a good time to get out there. Might still be able to get out this weekend without your wetsuit. Probably worth it if you're going to hang out in the water for a while, but at 68 degrees, you can definitely get in there with some trunks and feel good about it. So it looks like it's going to be a decent weekend for surf. As for fishing, it's going real strong. Offshore, seeing a whole bunch of tuna. Still some dolphins showing up, but the big catches are tuna. They're catching their limits on blackfin and yellowfin tuna. The piers, bridges, surf and sound are still real active. The surf is going crazy with a whole bunch of fish. The piers are going crazy with a whole bunch of fish. We're seeing blues, spot, some flounder, some pompano, black drum. It's striper season, so stripers are starting to show up. But the big news yesterday was the speckled trout. The Avalon Pier had one of the best runs on speckled trout that they've seen in years. Uh, yesterday morning it was just going off, a whole bunch of keepers. It died down a little bit in the afternoon, but there was still a whole bunch of speckled trout in the area. So lots of fishing going on, definitely a great time to be down here. Like I said, the beaches are empty, the weather is great, and the uh, prices of vacation rental homes are significantly reduced from their summer highs. So fall is definitely my favorite time to be down here. If you're thinking about coming down, please give us a look. OuterBanksVacations.com. I'll give you a quick peek of the beach. Like I said, it's pretty empty. We got some guys out here surf fishing, some people out enjoying a walk with their dog. But other than that, we got about three people out in the water surfing, and it's a gorgeous day to be here. So, hope you have a great Thursday and hope to see you soon.